Hey guys, I just want to say, wow, we made it to the fourth video. Uh, it's Friday, so TGIF. I'm so happy that I've gotten so many subscribers over the past couple of days, so I just want to say thank you. Uh, I hope you guys are enjoying my videos, so stay tuned, and here's another one. See you guys. There's my bus now. Perfect timing. I don't feel comfortable doing this. How do you feel about John Baylor? Uh, I like it because I get extra time and zero hour. So, be great. I think he's overrated. And I think he's just in it for the money, just like our government and the corporate fat cats who took down the Twin Towers. I don't like it. Yeah. I don't like the schedule. Not that bad, no. I feel like it may eventually be helpful, yeah. but I just feel like, I don't know, mixed feelings about it. You know, I think it's a great thing. I think it's a great thing. Yeah. You haven't even started it yet. That is truly hard. It's in your bachelor's or something. Here. I'm very disappointed it got taken down. I don't know, I didn't. I got up there for a reason. It's a hater. You're one of my zero hour heroes. It's a hater. I think it's probably good that the sophomores are doing it an extra year, even though a lot of them don't want to. Yeah, it's a Time. I mean, half the quarter of the students don't even pay attention. They sleep in class. They do their homework anyway. John Baylor. Wow, that is a great man. He's like my father almost. I love him. I love him. It's John Baylor, You're prepping for his test, dude. You gotta get ready. Let's go. Um, annoying, I guess. I don't know. I guess it does help to to certain people, but it depends on who you are. If you like to listen or not. I think it was helpful. I think it actually boosted my score and teaches you little tricks that you wouldn't have thought of before and helps you get through the test faster. So He thinks that the welding and all the kind of stuff we have back here in the shop is going to go away to some robot if you don't go to college. You can look my <laughs> What do you think about that answer? About what? That answer. <laughs> I think that it was completely uncalled for. It's too fascist. I think that not, you know, not enough thought was given to it, and I think that it was a rash decision made in the heat of the moment, and I believe that before... Kiss him. Kiss him. Kiss him. Kiss him. Kiss him. I won't kiss him. When somebody's filming you, such as Cody, this lovely man right here, do you look at the camera or do you look at him? That's a good question. Thank you. Because in documentaries, for the most part, they look at the person they're talking to. Well, that is because the camera is set off to the side. So you're catching kind of a slant, just like this. But when you're getting interviewed, it's such as this with the camera so close. What, what do you think is the right thing to do? I'm asking you that. Well, Dave, in terms of my answer, I've, I'm... I always tend to look at the camera. Well, I don't think you look at the camera as much as the camera looks at you. That's completely Whoa. fair because right now I'm not, I'm not looking at I'm not looking at the camera. I'm looking at the audience. That's that's what's really happening here. And I know that there's some sweaty nerds watching this video. Hey, don't talk about Richard like this. <laughs> Richard, this is an intervention. What do you think about John Baylor test prep? Um, it's not bad. I could do with it. I, I don't I don't feel I don't I don't have a feel for John Baylor test prep. Um, I guess it works. I could have used the help when I was your age, you know. I you know I don't know. That's extra eighteen minutes and zero hour. I hate it. You hate it? I don't know. I've never been in it, so I don't got anything. Man, 
I didn't use it last year, so I used the outside source and it worked pretty well. Oh my god, it's an absolute, well, you know what, I would say it's an absolute joke because I had other help, but I wouldn't say it's the worst thing in the world. I, guess. I don't understand. I, Can you explain to me in depth? In depth? Um, he does give great advice, but at one point he just, he doesn't explain why a lot. He, he just, he goes too fast. Too fast. He just goes way too fast. Right. So, that's what, Thanks. that's my opinion. That, that is. I don't even know who John Baylor is. Your slip for bowling? I mean, the guy is so helpful. I mean, it helps a lot. He's actually a cool guy, a slayer in my books. It sucks. <laughs> Literally, it sucks. Thank you. I don't know what that is, but I feel like we shouldn't have to test anyway because we all are smart in our own ways. Do our own stuff our own way. Honestly, I feel like like people don't pay attention to it, so there's no point in it. Like if like if they want to study for the S uh, ACTs on their on their own, let them. But and give them the option to do John Baylor, but don't make everyone do John Baylor. I think they should give you the option. I mean, it was it was pretty solid, pretty solid course. It helped me a little bit. But there's a lot of people that don't want to take it. They just sit there half. It. If they don't want to be there, then they shouldn't be forced to be there. It's good, yeah. I mean, kids need to be prepared, but most kids just don't care. And exactly what it's in zero hour, it takes up a lot of our time when we could be doing other homework. I think it's good for the students. I hope it really helps you with the ACT practice prep I heard. And the guys just look good. I think it's fantastic. You know, I increase my <laughs> English. The elite athletes have English to do warm ups from. 10 to 11, so... You can please I excuse him, he needs to warm up. Yeah. I felt John Baylor did not help me at all. I'm and a giraffe! <laughs> giraffe. And, um, yeah, so... John Baylor... He's a oh. great guy, but I just don't like his... work ethic. I like... the hours because each class is shorter now, but... John Baylor, personally, personally, I thought was a pleb. Just how he talked and all of his dumb sayings. And I didn't really enjoy it. John Baylor is the man of the year, I believe. It's a waste of time and it's <laughs> stupid. <laughs> yeah, don't come back, you nerd. <laughs> hey, shouldn't you be going somewhere? Yeah. Yeah, get to class. <laughs> Unbelievable. Gum. You fat! How about you try out for baseball? You suck. Stop! See, everybody's gonna think that music is the same edit because you wear the same sweatshirt every day. <laughs> roast. It's the second time I wore it. Complete roast. Griffin picked Breezy's lock to get into the room. Are you serious? <laughs> Is this an orange? What is it? Does it taste like an orange? Yeah. No, it tastes it's, like it's orange. literally just a miniature orange. Okay. I want it. You know it must be the money now. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, it's an old song. I don't know.
Oh, <laughs> you can take that! Damn, Rich! Hey guys! What would you like a shout out of? I don't know. Of what? Solve it. Change it! Whoa! 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 Bowling in Johnsburg. <laughs> I got that on camera. <laughs> hey, let's pick that up, guys. Hey, guys. Uh, I just want to say thank you for coming and watching my video. I hope you liked it. If you did, make sure to give it a like, maybe even comment under it. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. It would help me out tremendously.